Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and I've got a Bratz haul this time. I decided to do my Bratz separately because Bratz are my favourite doll and I have a little bit more of them than I did of the Monster High in the last one. Um, I don't know who these ones are but I got these from the same shop that I got the Barbie and the Kiyomi Hauntily from the last haul. Um, these were £2 each by the way. They were more expensive than the Monster High by like 50p or something, I don't know. Roughly, uh, they're from like the 2011-ish era, which I like that era, but there's things about it I don't like, like I don't like the fish lip thing, but I don't hate it, the eyes are super gorgeous and detailed, the clothes were really good quality, and I just missed that era, honestly, I just missed out on that one. Um, they don't have their shoes, I think they have some of their original outfit, I know that's obviously a Yasmin, that's probably a Jade, I don't know. You can correct me if I'm wrong, let me know who they are, what line they're from. My sister's already trying to take one of them from me, because she's a collector as well. Speaking of things my sister will want, this is her favourite line, and I got this, like, a month ago. This is the Chic Mystique doll. Is this the... I want to say the Chloe, but, um... No, the Jade. Um... Because, yeah... They all have different, like, hair and eye colour in this line, so it's harder to tell. I think, no, this is the Jade. I'm, I'm certain this is the Jade, but you can correct me if I'm wrong. Super pretty. And she'd look nice on my display for Halloween. So I'll put her right here. Next to Felicia, who was an absolute dream to own. That's another part of the haul, I guess. I got a Felicia recently. And, yeah, her lips were, like, non-existent once I cleaned them up. So I had to paint something on, but my boyfriend got me that and I was so over the moon happy to have my dream doll in my collection. Now I just need the Sweet Dreams one. And the last two dolls are from the same shop. They're from the same shop as the other ones. Um, these are Brat Sillas. This is the Megana Broomsticks. I don't know from which line, so you'll have to let me know. Uh, sorry about that. The phone decided to cut off on me, which is why I wanted a backup, like a camera or something. The last doll in this haul is... Is it Cloetta? From, I don't know which line, but she's posable. As you can see. There, and now she's standing right. She has this dress, which is probably a Barbie dress. Uh, yeah, so maybe it'd look nicer modelled on a Barbie. But she's posable. Which, you know, I really like. She needs cleaning up a bit. As you can see, her face is a bit grubby, but her hair looks to be an original style. And she's in pretty good condition overall. You know, and she has such good articulation, and her tattoo is in a different place than they usually are in these, which is interesting. Um, yeah, maybe I'll have to make her an outfit or something. But that was that for this part of the haul. Now, I have two more things that I got very recently. One is a Bratz Rock Angels carry case, which I found for £1 this weekend at the charity shop. Well, I don't know when that will be when this goes up. At uh, um, car boot sale, sorry. I mean, a pound, and it was in really good condition, so that's always fun. I'll insert a picture of that. And then the next thing is the Bratz Mansion. Someone in my village was selling this, and for such a small area, nobody ever has Bratz, or dolls, usually, around here. So when I saw that for £10, I had to go and get it. I think it was about £10. And my mum decided to pay for it for me, and I went and picked it up, and I was so happy to have a Bratz Mansion, because I don't have any Bratz play sets or anything like that, and it had loads of stuff with it. But I haven't had a chance to look through and see what stuff it came with. Um, it had the door and the staircase and, like, a table or a chair or something. So I'll you know, have pictures on my Instagram or something of that when it's set up and cleaned up. But right now, I'm just going to insert a quick picture. And that's it for this haul. So, 
I feel a little bit rusty because I haven't, you know, been uploading for a while. Um, but it feels good to be back, you know. It's Dolls are very therapeutic for me and with everything that's happened with me recently, I think it's going to do me some good to get back into this and, you know, share my passion with other people. So if you enjoyed this, then share with your friends, like, and comment. You know, tell me what you thought, tell me what videos you want me to do, because I only have a few doll unboxing and reviews planned at the moment. Uh, I don't have much uh, ready for content, but I do want to do more. So if you want to talk, me to talk about a topic, if you want me to do a tag, if you want me to do a Q&A, you know... Not many people watch my videos anyway, but if you just happen to stumble across this and you're interested to know more about me or my thoughts on things, preferably doll related, then, you know, leave me a comment, you know. I'm always open to trying new types of videos. Uh, so yeah, thanks guys. See you later.